We're recording. Some folks are hoarding. We've been ordered. Stay at home. I'm the daddy. And I'm the big boy. And, and we hope to bring you joy. Hello, everybody, and welcome to Daddy and the Big Boy. I'm Ben McCain, the daddy. And I'm Zach McCain, the big boy. And Dad, why did the old man, why did the old man fall in the well? I, I don't know. Because he couldn't see well. <laughs> I like that. That's a pretty good one, my yeah, friend. And our Uncle Butch, my <laughs> uncle, and my dad's brother, Uncle Butch, he sent that joke to us. <laughs> yeah, well, we appreciate Uncle Butch yeah. doing that. Speaking of, of Uncle Butch, you know, we did a TV show for uh, many years. You're aware of that, right? You're aware of that? And um, 12 years in Oklahoma City, six years at the NBC affiliate and six years at the ABC affiliate, 12 great years in Oklahoma. This fella is G.D. Spryland. He is one of the reasons that we live in California, that I live in California now, and Uncle Butch and I moved out here years ago, because this guy really inspired us and encouraged us to move to California. He's been in some great movies, big movies, like Godfather 2 and, and Apocalypse Now and just big movies. But he encouraged us. He said, if you boys think you might have a shot at the entertainment business, go for it. So, uh, so we did, and we visited with him a few times up there at his beautiful ranch, ranch home in uh, San Luis Obispo. But he's got a beautiful place. He's since passed away. But I found this uh, interview. It's on YouTube. And uh, you can find it on YouTube, G.D. Spradlin with the McCain Brothers. But we want to show you this little clip of G.D. talking about some of his movies. In your hardest role, G.D. No, Butch, they're all hard for me. I'm a terrified actor. I have all the confidence and um, assurance in the world until the director says action and I go to pieces. No, I don't buy that. <laughs> I, I just don't buy that. You folks are more... Uh, probably familiar with the face you may not be familiar with all of the films apocalypse now uh, you had a role in apocalypse now with a young very young harrison ford and a mark yeah. machine also uh the godfather part two with al pacino and robert duvall and then the formula with marlon brando also one-on-one -on -one with robbie benson we can go on and on what's been the most successful film so far financially that you've been in uh, well, let's see, Godfather 2 was a big hit, a surprising hit was one-on-one. Uh, -on -one. It was a small, yeah, a small film, but it played and played forever uh, and made uh, an awful lot of money you for one of them. mean Brothers. coach. Mean? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you mean just because I had little Robbie Benson beat up? <laughs> right, right. He deserved worse than what he got. <laughs> and you were also in uh, Tank, and Tank made some money with Joe Joyner. Yeah, another Oklahoma boy. Yeah. And, yeah. That's, uh, I, I had never met Jimmy before. We got along famously, though. We had the same backgrounds. G.D. Spradlin, he was from uh, Garvin County, around Paul's Valley. I think they call it the Daylight Township. But he was quite a guy, and I remember him telling me this story, how Francis Ford Coppola said, I want you to be in Godfather 2. And he said, well, Francis, I, I can't play an Italian. He said, well, I, I don't want you to play an Italian. I want you to play this senator from Nevada. And he goes, oh, Francis, I can do that. And he played a great role in uh, in that movie, Godfather 2. And if you haven't seen Godfather 2, you got to see it. it. I think it's even better than the first one. And, and our buddy G.D. Spradlin has a great role in that. And he's one of the reasons you're here today, too, because if I hadn't moved out of here, I wouldn't have met your mom, and you wouldn't be here on yeah. Daddy and the Big Boy. Yeah, and my mom wouldn't be the camera <laughs> man for, the camera <laughs> woman for the Daddy. The camera, camera operator. Yeah, for Daddy and the Big Boy, <laughs> like I said on the Mother's Day show. Yeah, that was a good one. You did a... But that was a surprise show, and I think she really liked it. You know, we're also getting a lot of comments on the cave show, Cave Zach Cave Two. Yeah, you know, that was a that was a fun one. Yeah, good memories in Oklahoma, and good memories of uh, old G.D. Spradlin. We just uh, loved him. And uh, Gray Fredrickson co-produced that movie. He was an Oklahoma guy. In fact, he moved back, and he still lives in Oklahoma. But that was a huge movie, one of my favorites, Godfather Two. We're still under lockdown, or. Mandatory stay-at-home orders. I'm still working. I just got back from work. 
But uh, hopefully they're going to loosen things up. In other states, they are loosening things up, and people are going back to work and going on about their business. But out here, still want people to wear their mask. And so we're encouraging everybody to, to just stay healthy and stay safe. Wash your hands all the time. Yeah. Wash your hands all the time. You're kind of uh, relaxed for this show today, huh? Yeah. <laughs> well, let's leave with their prayerful song. How about it? Yeah. Lord Jesus, please protect us from the coronavirus. Oh, Lord Jesus, please protect us. Those who want to harm us, Lord Jesus, Lord Jesus, please protect us. See you next time. Bye.